Country star John Rich is at it again and speaking out, sharing exactly what he thinks. And we want to know exactly what y'all think after you hear what John had to say about this. Now, this time, John Rich is standing up for Oliver Anthony. And as we all know, Oliver Anthony has captured the hearts of so many after sharing his off the charts viral hit, Rich Men North of Richmond which is a song that Oliver sings and delivers with such conviction, touching folks to their core throughout this country who are dealing with difficult times and the many struggles that have made their way into their homes. And since Rich Men North of Richmond has made such a connection with folks, and on top of that, Oliver Anthony is such a talented artist, the major record labels have now attempted to swoop in and grab Anthony for several million dollars offering several deals to the independent artist, which Oliver Anthony himself has already mentioned that he is in no rush to move forward with these kind of opportunities, and might I add that he has already turned down an $8 million industry offer. There is no doubt that Anthony is a superstar, but the industry seems like a place that Oliver does not have much interest in at this time. And John Rich believes that had he were signed to a label then, we all may have never even had the chance to hear Rich Men North of Richmond. Because just yesterday, John Rich turned to X, which used to be Twitter, where he shared, All the major record labels in Nashville are falling over themselves to lure Oliver Anthony. The irony is, if he would have signed to a label when he wrote this song, none of us would have ever heard it. His song fried their brains. Their greed is overriding their wokeness. Which again, the song speaks against the state of the country and its leaders, along with being noted as the blue collar anthem even. So with all of that, what we have seen in the past with Aldean just recently with Try That in a Small Town, I'm going to ask for you guys to head down to the comments and let us know if you agree with Rich, would the labels have kept the world from hearing Oliver Anthony's Rich Men North of Richmond had he been signed to a label prior to the releasal of the song? As always, guys, thank you all for tuning in here to CountryCast. That will be it for today's video.